Okay, so I work on fat cells and uh, interested in how adrenaline stimulates fat cell lipolysis and um, gene transcription and how uh, there's a kind of a fat cell called brown fat cell that actually stores some energy but also burns it and wastes it for the purpose of creating heat and it's a kind of an ancient mechanism for generating heat in the body when you're first born. And I always like to make the analogy of in the cave days if you were born in Michigan in March it would be pretty cold so you would go from a very you know mom's warm tummy to whatever the outside temperature is and so this was a mechanism to create heat from stored energy. Um, and it was thought for a long time that, well, it exists in humans in, at birth and then it disappears. Uh, and so you people that study this in rodents are studying something irrelevant. Uh, some of us thought that that was not quite true because there are examples of people, for example, that have adrenaline secreting tumors. Uh, and around those tumors, they have lots of brown fat. Proof of principle was that these cells could exist in adult humans. And uh, the interest is that we know from animal studies that certain strains of animals uh, are very capable of producing these brown adipocytes in their white fat in the intra-abdominal area. And whenever that's possible, these animals resist the development of obesity and insulin resistance. And so it's like a sink for excess energy that can just get burned off. Uh, so we're very interested in and that's driven by the same adrenaline process that we know about of, of the fight or flight type of response. And so we're interested in now identifying those transcriptional mechanisms that help to push a white fat cell, you might say, to be more of a brown fat cell. And some of the mechanisms that were classically thought to exist are true, but there's actually additional key pieces uh, or enzymes, kinases that are involved that were not known to be ex exist. And so that adds now another dimension to our understanding because you can't, as I like to say, you can't make the puzzle if you don't have all the pieces. And some of the work really recently since coming here it involves a whole nother way of activating this pathway. Uh, so we have adrenaline as one major or nor norepinephrine as one major mechanism, but there's now cardiac hormones uh, that are involved in blood pressure control that can actually do the same thing, and that's some work that we're just getting ready to publish this right now.